train rides are such an amazing sights to go on. You gotta love the train rides, just the bendiness of the coaches, the way the wheels turn, and the sound of the fantastic train whistle. You just can't get enough of it. So today I'm going to tell you about, because it's Six Flags Saturdays, the train. Now the train's not operating right now because, according to this image, they're doing track work on the bridge. Well, trestle actually. The bridges, I'm pretty sure, are currently also having track work, so yeah. Basically, the train at Six Flags is a steam-powered propane um, engine, which you know. There used to be two, but one got shipped off the Bush Gardens in Tampa, and there is a diesel engine called the Red Seal, but you know, it's only used for track maintenance, and you don't really see it. So, if, if there's one thing that you don't know about me is that, well, I obviously love going on the train, as you can tell by my shirt. I love trains, because trains are fun. So, yeah. The train pulls four coaches and a red caboose, in which the caboose has, well, you know, a microphone system and a generator for power. And, well, the steam engine is powered by non-pollution non propane, in which there's, like, this tube that, you know, connects to the tender, and, well, it goes into the firebox, and thus it heats up the water, thus creating steam, which pushes the pistons to drive the wheels. So, yeah. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say about the train's history. The train opened with the park, right, right as soon as the park first, first opened. And while there are many other Six Flags with a train, like there's one in Texas which has steam engines, some have like diesel, you know, hydraulic steam engines, which it's basically steam engine shell, but it's diesel powered. And while that's pretty much all I have to say about those trains. Although some Six Flags parks have um, a steam, no, they have, um, they used to have like a Thomas, the tank engine attraction called Thomas Town, which were diesel hydraulic Thomases that would pull Annie and Clarabel, but they had to be changed soon. And thus they still kept the E2 class design, but well, now they just repainted it. So that's pretty much all I have to say about the trains of Six Flags. So I must get back to the tracks. If you like this video, subscribe to Drew Thomas and click the bell to be notified when we upload a new video. This is Mr. Conductor saying, let's go. All right, I shall now disappear. Oh, wait, I can't. Uh, bye, everybody. Mm -hmm.